Alexandra, welcome to our fellow 3.2 event. How are you? I'm great, Manuela. Thanks. How are you doing? I'm great. Super excited to hear about the integrations that your team has built. So why don't you go ahead and tell us what's new? Yeah, so the first thing that we're really excited to introduce is our new integration with ClickUp. So ClickUp is a project management uh, action item tracking tool, and we have built out an integration with it very similar to the one that we already have with Asana and Jira that uh, I know that we've been using a, a little bit internally. And this is going to be a really great integration because even though it's great tracking your action items in Fellow, we know that sometimes it makes sense to have a dedicated place where you want to keep track of the many, many action items, especially if you're tracking projects and, and things across many weeks. So what we've done is we've built this integration so that you can either individually send action items from your Fellow meetings directly to a board in ClickUp, or you can set up the entire stream to send all new action items created within a particular stream over to ClickUp. So I think this is going to be really, really great for making sure that nothing falls through the cracks and, and all of your action items are, uh, are, are in one place and easy to work with for the whole team. So what's the second integration that you have today for us? The second integration is with a whole suite of Google documents. So you may have noticed that in Fellow Notes, I think last time we did a launch event, we introduced the ability to embed things like YouTube videos, Spotify podcasts, all sorts of interactive content within your notes. That makes it super fun, a little bit, um, a little bit fun to play with, especially when you start putting GIFs in there and, and, and things to kind of liven up the, the meeting notes. But uh, the what we've done this time around is we've added the ability to embed uh, Google Sheets, Google Slides, and Google Docs in your meeting notes too. So I really like this, especially the, the Google Slides portion, because a lot of meetings have slideshows, especially our weekly town halls. You know, we have a lot of presentations from people. And now instead of just putting a link so that you can jump over to a full new tab with the with the slideshow in it, we can display that right within Fellow. So you don't have to leave the note and you can scroll through the, the slides there. Same with spreadsheets. No longer do you have to open up a new tab and, and look at it elsewhere. It's all within there. You can collapse it so that it doesn't take up much space or you can expand it and look at it within the note. Um, but I, I've been really, really loving that. Okay, I love that. That sounds really helpful to have all your slideshows, your spreadsheets embedded within the fellow node. And I think someone from your team is coming to show us a live demo of this, right? Yes, I'm so excited. Ali from the engineering team is going to demo both of these things and I can't wait to see what she has to show. Okay, so let's welcome Ellie and check out these two integrations. Hi guys, I'm Ellie. I'm one of the engineers here at Fellow. I'm going to tell you about two of the new features that we're rolling out with Fellow 3.2. First of all, we now have a new integration with ClickUp. And second, we now support embeds with Google Docs. These have been two of our very highly requested features and so we're really excited to roll them out for you. So when I want to set up ClickUp, I'm going to go to my user apps and integration settings. We have the new card here and I can just select connect from the menu. It will authenticate me through ClickUp and then I can choose which workspace I want to sync with. It's great because you can actually choose multiple workspaces and choose between them when you want to connect from the stream. So I'll connect both of these. It'll send me back to Fellow and confirm with the toast. Now, when I'm in a meeting and I want to choose one of my to-dos to send a click up, I can just select it from the kebab menu, like this. So I'll choose one of the workspaces that I set up, let's say my personal one. I choose my project space. I don't have any folders here yet, but I do have a list that I can send it to. And this is a dev to-do, so I'll send it there. I can confirm what the text will be, and then I'll send it over. Once this is closed, it will show a pill beneath the action item showing that it's been linked to ClickUp. If I click on this, it will take me to ClickUp and show the action item. Here I can see all of the information about the task, the name, the stream, the assignee. And if I go back to Fellow and change anything, it will also sync over. So for instance, if this is due on the 28th, this will sync over. The grayscale means that it's syncing. I wait a little bit. And when it's back to full color, I go to ClickUp and I can see that the due date is now Monday. What's great about the ClickUp integration is that it is a two-way sync between ClickUp and Fellow, which means that any changes done in the ClickUp task here will show up in my stream. Let's say I change the text here. 
and I say um, additional info. When I go back to fellow, I'll see the update there and it will show that it's syncing. So this applies for the uh, text, the due date, the status, whether it's checked off, as well as the assignees. So this means that we will sync assignees based on the email addresses. As long as they match in Fellow and ClickUp, you can assign to anyone on your team. Finally, I can configure ClickUp at the stream level, same as Asana. So if I go to my stream settings here, I go to the integrations tab, which now also contains Asana. I can choose a workspace, folder, list, I'll configure that for every single to-do in the entire stream. Uh, this is great if you know where you want to send every single action item for an entire meeting. So next I'm going to show you our new Google Docs embeds. And what's great about this integration is that people can now follow along with your shared content without losing focus from the meeting. And we think that's really valuable. So let's say I have a Google Slides presentation and I want to put it in my note. I'll go ahead and use the modal here to embed. Paste the link here, it recognizes this is Google Slides. I'll embed it and it shows up in my note. So I can now cycle through these slides. I can use presentation controls. I can do a whole bunch of other stuff. And if I don't want to use the embed modal, I can just paste a link. Let's say this time I have a Google document. Paste it right in there. We still have access to the link as well as seeing the embedded content. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy these features as much as we do.